Okay guys, uh, this is actually my old Trans Am. <laughs> so uh, I guess the current owner or area here uh, decided to let it sit around for a little bit. And uh, I got hold of the title and I've given it to my friend Mikey, uh, who is known as Two Wrenches. And what we're, the plan is gonna be, is gonna be to rescue this vehicle. Uh, so we're gonna hopefully have you as part of the process uh, see everything from stem to stern, Steve, from sitting in this to what it's going to become later on. So I'm hoping you'll wish us luck on this this project. The funny thing is, is when I first came in, I kind of had some hope because I thought it was, you know, just kind of sitting out, kind of like this other car over here. Uh, but in reality, I come in and like it's overgrown. It's like buried. Like I don't even know how we're going to get it out. So the flatbed is on the way now. Uh, to get it, we got a winch to pull it out. Um, and the project is going to begin, so this is going to be exciting. I hope you guys watch it. Okay, so the hood's open. Uh, we're probably the brakes are probably seized. Uh, the old nitrous kit spouts are all locked up. So we got the chain under it, and we're going to try to pull it out right now. So let's see how this all works out. <laughs> It's rolling. It's rolling. Getting more height because it's coming out of the hole. Yeah. Ready to go. Yeah, it's rolling. I don't have a lot of. Uh... So this right here has actually grown into the side skirt. So we're gonna cut it off. I can't believe it's rolling. Watch that rip right there. Yeah. Settled. Test it to see how close that front is over there on the right. Oh, I got past it? Yeah, you're good. All right. Not as bad as I thought. No, not even close. No, I I straight when I shut this door. I don't know if you're straight. How's the tire on the other side? Dude, I can't believe it. Rolling and everything. And your other exhaust pipe is over there. It's got a tree growing out of it. That thing is wrapped around it. Wow. Yep. So that's what the interior looks like right now. Which is actually pretty clean under here. So here's the new owner, Mikey Two Wrenches, the one and only man. He's going to be rebuilding this bad boy back to its former luster, and we're going to be following a little bit. I am really excited, so you guys stay tuned. We'll talk to you later.